step in their own end of the field. And lots of running room this time. Up right side of the offensive line. Just a nice job right here getting the seal, getting the push outside. Linebacker Bryce Hager comes underneath. That's whose that's who's responsibility that was for the tackle. He felt like he could get underneath, not with the speed of Tony Pollard. And on the draw, Pollard, first down, flag in the backfield. Nice pickup of 9 or 10. And Dak finds his man, Pollard again, down to the 20. And a late... Jason Witten just seems to be such a happy camper and so excited to be back. And Tony Pollard all the way into the end zone. And the Cowboys are excited about that fourth-round rookie out of the University of Memphis. It's one of the areas of his game that I was not aware of. You talk about a guy who was a returner who played all three wide receiver positions for Memphis. But running between the tackles, how effective was he going to be there? Watch this. I mean, and he has said, you know, that, that is one of the things that I love proving people wrong on. Great balance right there on contact. Just forward the whole time. That's a that's a nice. On once the bullets start flying for real. Coming up in less than two weeks. Zach Prescott gets the start. The handoff to Pollard. And Pollard gets to the edge for Joe Looney to make a play. Here's third down. Pollard trying to find some running room. Gets over the right side and has the first down. Bernardrick McKinney, the first to contact him. A.J. Moore helped finish him off, but a first down for the Dallas Cowboys. Pollard showing you some of that instincts that Jerry Jones has been bragging about. A little slow read, comes to the line of scrimmage, and then bounces outside to get the first down. That's a nice job of running. Drafted in the fourth round by the Cowboys. Been treated like a starter. Had only seen 21 snaps in the first two games combined. I think some of that's by design this year in particular. No Ezekiel. Great, legitimate number one, elite number two, elite receiver. Power, good patience, and he found the hole into the secondary and pulled down at the 23-yard line. That's a 25-yard burst for Pollard before Johnson Batamosi could bring him down. Batamosi did a nice job on the back end, but this is what happens when you have success in the throw game. The passing game can open up the run. 73 reports is eligible. 73 is eligible. You know, if they're threatening you on the back end and all of a sudden you go a nine, dime or nickel, you got more people in the game. Your runners aren't as heavy in terms of defenders. So you're vulnerable to the run in those cases. From the 23-yard line on first down, Pollard to the edge, and Pollard tripped up in tonight. Second and 18. Swing out of the backfield to Pollard, and Pollard scoots out of bounds. At the Rush with pressure coming, dumps it off. Pollard looking for running room. Breaks a tackle with a flag down. Pollard down the sideline and nudged out by Lonnie Johnson just shy of the goal line. That flag, though, on the edge at the 21. 